Dreamworx Trolls War Tour. It was a beautiful day in Trolls Village. Queen Poppy and the other trolls were having fun singing, dancing, and hugging. When Biggie arrived, calling, Help! I'm being attacked by a monster. The monster was just about with a message for Poppy. But who was it from? King Poppy read the message. Queen Barb, the queen of rocker trolls, she said. King Peppy explained to Poppy that they were not the only trolls in the world. Poppy and her friends loved pop music, so they were the pop trolls. But there were other trolls who loved different kinds of music. There were rocker trolls, classical trolls, country western trolls, funk trolls, and techno trolls. King Peppy opened a map showing where each of the six troll tribes lived. Every tribe had a special string to make their music. I get it, Poppy said. Queen Bot wants to bring the six strings together so we can make music for a big happy party. Branch and Poppy weren't too sure. They thought Queen Barb was planning to take their string. You can't trust other trolls, King Peppy warned. They're different from us. But differences didn't matter to Poppy. They were all trolls. Poppy left to meet the other trolls in a balloon called Shayla B. And Branch went along to help Poppy and keep her safe. Biggie and Mr. Discos also went by accident. They climbed into the balloon to eat the cotton candy Poppy had a, for Bob, and they fallen asleep. Time for a Trolls World Tour, Poppy exclaimed. The first land they reached was Sipneyville, where the classical trolls lived, but it had been destroyed. A little flute named Penny Whistle explained that Queen Bard had used loud rock music to blast the town and steal the string. Poppy realized they had to stop Queen Bard, but they need help from the other trolls. Soon, Poppy, Branch, Biggie, and Mr. Dinkles arrived on Lonesome Flats, where Mayor Delta Dawn and the other country western trolls lived. Their music sounded sad, so Poppy decided to cheer them up with a round medley of pop tunes. The country western trolls hated the pop music. They threw Poppy and the others in the jail cell. I only wanted to unite the trolls, Poppy said. Luckily, a country western troll named Hickory helped them escape. I love your message about music bringing trolls together, he explained. The country trolls... Western trolls chased Hickory and the pop trolls right off the cliff and into the river. Splash! Hickory built a fancy route to carry them to safety. Funk trolls, here we come, Poppy cried. Far down the river, the pop trolls spotted a giant spaceship in the sky. Poppy checked her map and saw a drawing of a spaceship that looked just like the one overhead. I think we found the fun trolls, Poppy announced. Suddenly, beams of light shone on the pop trolls and drew them up onto the sh into the ship. Poppy was honored to meet the king and queen of Funk and see to see her friend Cooper. He had discovered that his trolls tribe was the Funk Trolls. Suddenly, Queen Bob was and her army of rocker trolls attacked. We're the here for your string, fun trolls, the queen snarled. Hand it over. Thinking quickly, Cooper protected his friends by ejecting them from the spaceship in the bubble. Branch was ready to head back to Trolls Village so they could protect the pop string, but Poppy pulled it out of her hair. It's right here, she said. When Queen Bob saw the pop music string, she zoomed down and snatched it out of Poppy's hand. 
Then she ordered the, her rocker trolls to grab Poppy and take her to Volcano Rock City for the big concert. Now I have all the strings, Queen Barb boasted. I am going to play the ultimate power droid. It turned all trolls into rocker trolls. Thinking quickly, Poppy jumped onto the stage and got the trolls singing. Queen Bob couldn't believe it. The song sounded great. Soon, the trolls were celebrating their musical differences by singing beautifully in their own styles and rhyme, rhythms. It was a great song. The trolls sang and danced together. They were different from one another, but they all loved music. The trolls made happy music well into the night. From then on, everyone lived a perfect harmony. The end.